All right, what is up, fellow people of YouTube? This is Mick here from Reality Tech, and in this video, it's not going to be a review video per se, but I'm going to take a look at the new Alec again. Uh, well, not really take a look at that, but I'm going to try to track some aircraft with it. So I'm going to go ahead and get this all rigged up, and we will see if I can actually track an aircraft using this little $20 USB dongle. So stay tuned here. All right, now my audio, audio quality took it here, so I do apologize, but I finally got everything rigged up, and unfortunately right now my area is a dead zone for aircraft. There isn't much around, but we do have one aircraft. Um, and this is pretty interesting what it does show you here. Um, you get the ICAA 24 ident. You get the registry number of the aircraft. You can get its current altitude, latitude, longitude, Speed, 266 knots, heading 146, and it's climbing. It gives you the type um, and everything like that. Now, I've currently got the track. Um, it is a Challenger. It is a probably a business jet. Let's zoom in on it here. It looks like it is flying away from us now. It is probably... These rings are 50-mile rings, so... It is flying away, but this gives you all the information that's getting here. Like I said, this is all the types. It is a USA flagged aircraft. Um, it gets a lot better during the day. Um, this one isn't showing it up at all. And I can only assume that is a military aircraft. Um, but yeah, I mean, this is extremely neat for a $20 USB dongle. Um, It'd be a lot better if you're near an airport, to say the least. Um, then you can see what aircraft are flying over, you know, as you're watching them right outside your house or whatever. Uh, but I did want to show you this, and I think it's really cool. <laughs> Again, I definitely recommend this dongle. Um, and I'll put a link to the video of the dongle if you guys are interested. And, yeah, that is about it. Uh, next, I really want to tackle trying to maybe intercept the weather satellite images. I think that'd be pretty cool, but don't quite know if that'll happen. So I know I need to build a better antenna for this. And if anybody's got any ideas or tips on how to build a better antenna for this, that would be pretty awesome. Um, and I may do another video of this during the day when there's a lot more aircraft flying around, too. But I really do appreciate you guys watching, and I hope you guys have a great day. And please feel free to hit the subscribe button and like the video and enjoy more Reality Tech videos. Thanks for watching, guys.